What's up my pain and suffering enjoyers? And today we're talking about elusive staking. I can say that this build works with low investment, but overall I'm not very satisfied how it looks like now. While you're watching the gameplay, let's see what we get with, I think, two divine investment. Uh, we're assessing just uh, pretty straightforward setup, uh, elusive, opportunistic for more damage and uh, reflection and power charge tree. Uh, that's nothing much to say here because the concept is to stack elusive and to stack the and to stack the effectiveness of elusive. So this thing is pretty busted because um, you get almost 100% crit chance and more than 1000 crit multiplier for nothing we just have assassin node some dagger mastery on the tree and one support gem called night blade um, this is the current version and it doesn't work well because uh, we have 100% critical strike chance only when we use um, Assassin's Mark and uh, other stuff, so um, I didn't uh, get it to this POB. So now we have the actual setup uh, and we have Mark on hit here. Yeah. So, uh, what's the problem? Um, at first, we rely on our evasion rating, and if we do not await something, we can be instantly dead because uh, some physical damage can one-shot us. And the second problem is that we do not have 100% critical chance overall because the elusive buff decreases over time. So uh, when we critical strike an enemy and uh, there is maybe three uh, or four seconds past, we do not get 100% crit chance, we don't have so much multiplier, and if we don't crit, our damage is uh, pretty zero. That's why um, with low investment setups uh, it doesn't work really well. Uh, in this video shoot up, you see that the tier 16 mapping is pretty good but not for all modes and the bossing is trash um, i'll link to trees the current one and the ideal uh, which i uh, got to have um, so this is only level 88 but even if we get to level 91 and to get this node even 92 i think uh, with cold exposure that's not the, um, the case oh, we're still uh, lacking boss and damage and you saw this on the Hydra fight the boss was possessed but it doesn't matter we didn't even uh, got 10% uh, of his life that's why mm, try to avoid this uh, thing if you do not have much currency to waste on it or just use it as a leak starter so uh, white and yellow maps are great uh, red maps can be sustained uh, with some accidental deaths but it's not for end game this version may be useful for the end game but uh, still we have Two problems not enough life sustain and uh, and some relying on evasion so we are just <laughs> rng based and we can die yeah we have great movement speed uh, good clear but uh, i think that's not enough to be the great experience still i suppose this night blade or just overall elusive uh, staking buff will be nerfed because the numbers are crazy even with all those nerfs that GGG brought us um, the last times but I suppose that that's not the case about this build so like subscribe 
leave your comments in the commentary section and see you in the next video goodbye